What's up YouTube, this is LDS Reliance. Today we're going to use the Trojan Hydrolink watering system to refill the water on my batteries. The first thing that we're going to do is we're going to make sure that we have the right equipment. So obviously we're going to need some distilled water. We're going to need some protective equipment, so eye protection and gloves in case there's some kind of a spill. It's also maybe a good idea to have some baking soda on hand in case there's a spill to neutralize the acid. Now in a previous video we already installed the Hydrolink system so all we're going to need today in addition to the installed system is our hand pump. Before we get started however the first thing that we need to check is to make sure that the batteries are fully charged. So as you can see here the batteries are in float which means they're fully charged. So we will disconnect the solar charging system as well as any loads on the batteries before we begin. Okay once our batteries have been fully charged and have been disconnected from the system We'll open up the battery bank and take a look at our batteries. Now you'll notice, and mine are a little bit covered up here, but underneath these, underneath here you'll see there's a little dot there. And that's a little window into the water level of the system. It will be white or kind of a clearish color if it's low and it will be dark or black if they're full. So most of my batteries look like they're pretty full, but I want to make sure that these are topped off because they've been running in production for about a month or two now. So what we need to do is we need to put our distilled water on the ground and open up the lid. Then we're going to take our hand pump and we're going to put the end of it into the water. And we're going to prime the system by squeezing the pump. Now we're going to take the dust cap of the Hydrolink system and we're going to remove the cap and we're going to mate the end of the pump into the dust cap until it clicks. And then we're going to use the pump and pump into the batteries. I don't think my mic is going to pick this up, but you'll be able to hear the water going through the tubes into the batteries. Now you want to be careful not to overfill the system or you'll lose electrolyte and your batteries will lose performance. I think all of them are now full. All of the little windows are black so all we have to do is stop pumping we push this little button on the end here and that will disconnect the dust cap or the uh, the port and we put the dust cap back on and we're done all right thanks for watching guys we'll see you next time be sure to hit like and also subscribe if you're not already a subscriber